And here we are on my couch with reveal the shield for Scepter. Yeah, so he is Marshall's seven dollars research truck for the cold. Press the reveal auto bar to set the con allegiance. Well, I'm pretty sure the kids can tell what allegiance he belongs to, so Wait, 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 let me get this right. We will assimilate. Nah, I just don't look quite right. Which I was in anyway. Whatever. We will assimilate. <laughs> now, anyway, on his profile, Perceptor is one of the most brilliant scientists ever produced by Cybertron. Because he was built, not made. Okay. Oh, no. <laughs> Let me redo this, because that just brings out the age old question to can Transformers reproduce, and I do not want to get into a tangent about that. <laughs> okay, let's redo this. Perceptor is one of the most brilliant scientists ever produced by Cybertron. Much of the technology the Autobots take for granted is due to his discoveries. It is rare that he actually builds or invents anything himself, but his insights make his insights makes it possible for engineers and inventors to continue the pace of technology and development. Okay, it's kind of cool, but one see I think here is his arm. It's not attached to his body. Look at that shoulder joint. It's hella weird. Hello, weird. But, eh, we'll see it later. Let's get this full out of packaging. So, let's. Eh, give you skewed vision. First, I wish. This is all jacked up. This cram so much crap that it doesn't need. Boy, no. I mean, come on, look at this. And what the hell is this? Is this supposed to be a stand? What's with this crap here? Ah, anyway. Good old two forward instruction main wheel and some So I want fallback, bumblebee, tracks, Gretgar, Jazz, Laser Prime, I already got the Scepter. I already have the battle in space two pack. 
I want lug nut and I want grappel because for some reason he is French now. So let's continue on with our journey. Here at that productions we are always interested oh, not we I I'm the only one doing this I am always interested in bringing you the most interesting unboxing methods that you have ever seen in your entire bloody life because I know not a person on YouTube the judges that does the hell that does his unboxing videos quite like this and thinking back on my earlier words I don't know why I'm talking with whatever accent I'm speaking in I just don't oh good they, they, they double knotted this crap the hell um do not know what accent I'm speaking it's just freaking weird, and the background noise is Sons of Guns on Discover. Come on now. Ah. Let me crap, get out here. And the snoring is from my dog, Sugar. So do not mind. No, not, not the dog, nor you, the wire. I do not want you to get out. You can stay as long as you want. No, no, I'm lying about that too. I do not want you to stay here as long as you want. Well, at my actual house, not this page. You can stay at this page however long you want. However, it's going to be really, really weird. Because at the end of this video, I'm going to be talking to nothing. And see, you can actually see the chrome right out under here. It looks really good. But I hope... Ah, uh, no, it's not this transport. You can see it in the box side too, so... And here we have reveal the shield. Ratchet, not ratchet, not ratchet, you idiot. It's Perceptor. Reveal the shield. Deluxe class Perceptor. At an angle. So because of how my lighting and the red is not orange, it's just this weird. Uh, you see this? This is not how it actually looks like in real life. This slide is yellow, and so it's the opposite is current. What should be lighter is dark. Oh no, it, it color corrected. So this is how it kind of looks like, but you should buy one yourself. Yeah, it's just turned to yellow hue again, so. See you guys later, and we can see if we get this crap color correct. Ooh! Color corrected again. And here is Transformers View the Shield Perceptor in this Arctic Research Vehicle thingamajiggy. It's got like fucking yellowed windows. The um, regular wheels in the back and then this monstrosity tire treads in the back. It's like Because this vehicle formation is kind of obvious, what the fuck some parts will be, especially look at the back, the 
the bottom. Sick shit, man. But I would have liked it better if they could formate the arms better to hide it in robot mode. Cause you just see the shoulder joints up here, and you see um the the forearms right here because of the big ass wheels. It's really fucking weird. So let's hmm another fireworks. Let's get Perceptor changed up. Just move this. Don't transform this yet. It'll be just easy to done. Just open up the windows. And, or the car doors. And there you go. You got the legs all fucking ready to do shit. Then... And then the the trunk becomes his shins and knee cap. Then his feet pull down here. And then the tire treads just slide down and inside. And then the car door just goes in in there and then these actually plug in together and then solid formation then you snap it up in there and here's here's what I really hate about this fucking thing The back portion is just a bitch. Did I just get the fucking arms? You're supposed to put them in, innards. Then you push it. Holy shit. And then the window just folds down. And then push the. This is really a tough shit to do because you gotta get this. You gotta f get this shit right on the black tab, which is a bitch to get through. Which why I'm gonna do this shit off camera. It's fucking annoying. Because it feels like you're gonna break the damn thing. Motherfucker. There. See, now clips in like that but this is a really shitty ass tab you're gonna break that someday then just <sighs> motherfucker motherfucker then it tabs in like that the red tab goes in the black tab but doesn't really quite go in that fucking well and this is the shitty disappointment the arms it's a shitty disappointment because the arms are like, what the flaming fuck? Because look at this fucking, there's not, it's, uh, what the fucking shit is this? It's not even level, the fucking thing, so I have to... And for the rest of it, it's just... 
and then you can have like then the knees clip in and there you go that's the entire fucking transformation look how no, like, put up there look how retarded his arms look so much fucking annoying so stay tuned there's two more v's to go stay tuned perceptor will prime live long well according to my scientific calculations I believe that he will die momentarily. Ah, uh, Perceptor! You fucking bastard! Ah, uh, I only have a stomach ache! Ah, uh, motherfucker! Well, sir, is this is regarding about the movie? That was not me, that was an actor playing me. Yeah? Huh? Well, no fucking wonder. Your arms are so goddamn limp. They look like midget arms. Hey, hey, hey! Blame motherfucking Hasbro. Oh, shizzle dizzle, the doctor can cuss. Well, Rodimus, what do you think the new course of action should be? You're gonna die, motherfucker. Oh, ah, shit, not there, not there! Ah! Actually, forget that. I got this fucking backpack to work properly. I forgot the instructions and it got stuck on the fucking tab. So, yeah, they they work. But, floating shoulders. Floating shoulders is pretty shitty. And, that's a long ass firework. So, it's kind of shit. This is still kind of crap figure. But, eh, it's still a good buy, so, go do it.